can. Okay, and welcome. Welcome to Facebook Live. I'm Liz Holpin, Pinhole Quilting, and Pete, my husband, is behind the camera. And we also have Anna, one of our customers. Hello. Who happened to pop in today. She might be regretting that now because uh, <laughs> <laughs> suddenly it went from, oh, I'll just pop in and get the, the, the thread, uh, yeah, the thread, thread you wanted yep. because you were, you were kind of halfway through a project. Halfway through a project and run out, and, yes. Uh, it happens, <laughs> yes. it happens. We quite often get mail order from people who've done exactly that, yeah. but they're not as convenient as you no, are. No, I'm very lucky I'm down the road. Exactly. <laughs> so you, you find out, well, you emailed, didn't you? Yeah. You popped in. I said, oh, yeah, it's fine. Facebook Live's on. Mark will sort you out. <laughs> And then Mark said, oh, Anna's here. Um, you know, she can just pop in. And then we saw Anna's coat. Yeah. So then we said... <laughs> Which I wore especially. She wore especially. <laughs> and then we said, oh, we could be nice to get a photo of that. And before you know it, we're doing Facebook Live with Anna. <laughs> That's what happens here. You see, we grab you, we reel you in to the world of long arm quilting. Yeah. So t tell us a little bit about your coat and what, right. well, how you created it. The coat, I've got a sit down machine, which I had beginning of the year, and I decided I was just going to quilt a big piece of fabric to try all the different designs out. Brilliant. So I'd got this piece of pink and the lovely yellow to contrast with it. And I just quilted it all over and then made it into a coat. It's fantastic. What I, I love is kind of, it's it's so improv. It's exactly what we encourage people to do. Trying out loads of different uh, stitches in terms of the stitches, the, the designs and things, and really being playful with it, which is exactly it, yeah. what it looks like. Yeah, it was, You've it had was fun with every it. single design. I've got loads of books and I just tried all the different That's designs it. to see what I could do and what the machine could do. There we go. And it's interesting as well, because we're talking a little bit about, we briefly touched on colour. I went on off on a complete paradigm shift to Sonia Delaunay. But what we were saying was, you know, this is orange on yellow. Now, it might not show so well on a Facebook um, live feed, but this is pink with the orange. And actually, it looks quite almost like yellow on pink and or, um, pink on uh, yellow is what it looks like because of what the eye does yeah. to change colour when you're actually looking at it. It's kind of kind of strange how the eyes do that. Yeah. Um, yeah. So it's a really good test of not only your stitching and your ability and playing with the new machine, getting used to the machine but getting yeah. used to the machine. Yeah. So win-win. And you've obviously done dressmaking before, because I, have, I can yes. see from the finish, <laughs> that this is not the finish have, of a beginner. Yes. I've, I've so it's beautifully, things, so. yeah, it's beautifully done. A practice. So, covered uh, buttons. Covered buttons. Quilted covered buttons as yes. well. Well, there we go. Thank you so much <laughs> for being welcome. a willing victim, sort of. <laughs> sort of. Yeah. We, we, we locked the door. <laughs> That's it. Hopefully it inspires everybody to get on and do some quilting. Yeah, and I'm going to get my bobbin thread and carry on Absolutely. Now. We, won't, <laughs> we won't hold you up from your sewing machine. Okay. Right. All right. Take okay, care then. Thank you. All right. Bye. Thanks then, Anna. That was absolutely brilliant. Anna's now leaving because we've opened the door again. We wouldn't let her out until that had been completed. So it's, it's so nice, you know, when people come and bring their makes and show us what they've done on their long arms. Absolutely fantastic. And yesterday, Pauline, and I put it on the, the uh, email that you should have received if you're on our mailing list. Uh, the email I sent, which had one of the quilts that Pauline, who works with us and has been setting up the classes, done a brilliant job on, thank you, Pauline, so much for setting up the long arms this week. Um, Pauline is part of a group, Combating Quilters, who were well-deserved winners of the group category at First Order Quilts this year. Um, and I, my, I am a very part-time member of Combatant Quilters, but I, I like to think that I contribute in other ways by providing various fabrics and accessories and other bits and pieces to the group. Um, I went to the first group meeting in January and I'm going to the Christmas dinner. So that gives you an idea of how my year has gone. But Combatant Quilters take part in lots and lots of charity uh, things, as, as do many quilt groups and many of our quilters. And I think it's a, it's a wonderful thing that people use their quilting skills to give such a personal gift to the people who receive it. Uh, one of the groups, which I'm, I'm going to visit at the last week of November, with Sharon, who's got a sit-down long arm and our Amara. Um, Sharon does some fantastic quilts and she is very good at sort of getting in touch with different groups and charity organizations. Um, there are various ones that the group does, Quilts for Care Leavers being one of the big ones, obviously, but also uh, one that's in London for uh, trafficked women and, ch and sometimes their children. 
um, that's a really fantastic one. And another one that's up in Hall Green in Birmingham, very close to the Cotton Patch, actually, just down the road. Uh, they meet in the, the Quaker Meeting House. So Sharon is, I'm going along with Sharon and we're going to take up some quilts. And one of them was the quilt that Pauline had finished. Uh, it was a quilt that was originally started by my mum, um, Jean Sewell, who started the Cotton Patch with my dad, Jeff. And I've been going through all her um, stuff in her sewing room because unfortunately they're both in a care home now, which I know happens to a lot of our customers as well. Um, as our parents get older, um, the inevitable happens. Um, anyway, so I've been tidying up at her sewing room and, and getting some of those things that she, she didn't manage to finish. And it's been a really good use of those fabulous resources and the partial quilts that she'd done. So Pauline's made, I think, three quilts out of it, something like that, which has been brilliant. So we're going along. So I'll take some photos of that event when we go along. I might post some photos of the Compass and Christmas dinner. It depends if it happens as some of these things can do. They can get a little bit rowdy and, you know, it can be what happens on the Christmas dinner stays at the Christmas dinner. So we'll have to see. We'll have to see how rowdy the group get. Okay, now Pete and I, how, how are we doing Pete? I've just been doing a complete monologue since um, Anna left. We're doing all right, although as I've just posted to one of the uh, comments on Facebook, we are suffering still a little bit from jet lag, aren't we? We are. Honestly, honest, really, it's not just the time change of the whole clock's going, falling backwards in, on Sunday. Well, you know, it's, it's only a five hour time difference, but my goodness, we didn't, we didn't do well on the cl plane flight though, did we Pete? And that, you know, if you do an overnight flight and you, you get like an hour and a half, two hours sleep, you are really going to have a problem when you land. I always used to be really good at being able to sort of get on the plane. I'd have eaten before, just water and go to sleep, even in the smallest space available. Uh, but I didn't manage to do that this time. So uh, anyway, we'll get there. Hopefully this weekend we'll recover. But it's been a bit of a it's been a bit of a sleepy week in the evenings, hasn't it, Pete? We've been full of sleep. Uh, just a little bit. Uh, yes. So we're trying not to pretend it's anything to do with our advancing years. No, trying not to. Trying not to. Trying to sort of go, no, it must be the jet lag. It's the jet lag. For goodness sake, it's the jet lag. What the hell? The fact that neither of us can keep our eyes open once we hit the sofa. Um, neck cushions on everything. You know, it's like we're on the plane again. Anyway, it's quite a look, I can tell you. We are delighted that we, having been to Houston and Handy Quilter in the States have done a fantastic Purple Friday promotion. We've got the Purple Friday promotion in the UK. So for anybody who is considering purchasing a long arm, have a look at the deals. We've got some fantastic offers on new long arms and you really should take a look. So we're gonna go through a few of them today. And I'll put up on Facebook and on our website some of those deals. They're going to be valid till the end of the month. And the £500 deposit will secure that long arm for you with as long as you take delivery. Um, or oh, you do need to pay for it before the end of February. So a couple of weeks before the delivery, we ask for final payment and then deliver it to you. Some of them are installation as well. There we go. So I'm hoping that um, Pete is going to be available to move the camera shortly so that we can get a slightly different angle on this. Um, I'm, we could move that, to, oh no, we'll, we'll do the Capri there, it doesn't matter, it's not too bad. So we're just in the middle of setting up for the classes, so we have a little bit of detritus um, around, but it's, we try to make it a little tidier. Let's talk about Houston first. Let's talk about, what a fantastic, I mean, Houston, if you've never been, and I know some of you have and sadly couldn't make it this year or for whatever reason. But my goodness, Houston didn't disappoint. You know, pre-COVID, Pete and I went in 2019 and we had a fabulous time. Absolutely fabulous time. It was the first time Pete had been, the first time he'd ever been to the States. It was. Houston, his first ever visit to the States and he goes to Houston. I go to a cool festival. And you go to a cool festival. Oh, yeah. oh highlight That's of your life, Pete. Something. Dreamed of yeah, since I was 18. <laughs> absolutely. Since you're 18, you thought, I'm going to be going to a quilt show, quilt festival. Heavens. That's the thing. Um, if you're a quilter, you absolutely love it, of course. We, do it, we did Quilt Market, which is for suppliers, and we did fest, uh, the Quilt Festival, which is for consumers. And the one follows very closely onto the other with a very, a very short changeover, amazingly short changeover. It's like a day and a half. Um, and Handy Quilt is there the entire time. 
gosh, they must be exhausted by the end of it. So well done to everybody at Handy Quilter um, who kept going throughout that entire time, demoing throughout the whole time to their customers and potential customers. So we were talking to them about new products and we had to go on the Moxie XL, which is very exciting XL. Um, the link on the webs on the email that I sent today will have a link to a little video that I did with Adam Ratliff of Adam So Fun, who is a big hit with many of our customers. And he does some really good how-to videos. So if you haven't um, been ever been introduced to Adam, you really need to check him out. And we had, yeah, we had a bit of a laugh. We had a bit of a laugh. We were trying for like three days to do the video, but every time we tried to do it, he was too busy or people came up and, and wanted to have a demo on the stand or we were dashing off to go and see somebody. So uh, eventually we did it before the show started on the final day. Well, no, the Saturday, wasn't it, before we left. So anyway, great to see Adam, really good to, to meet him. And um, I've been, you know, been watching his videos on and off really since he started doing them. Um, and since one of our customers said, you really need to see this guy, he's really good. And he is. Uh, um, and he, he just presents in a really lovely style, uh, but he's also extremely knowledgeable about the machines and techniques and he really tries things out and, and gives you some real insight in how you can do your quilting better, easier, etc. So have a look at that video, um, it shows the Moxie XL and that will be coming out in the UK um, 2024. So we have slightly different electrical standards here in the UK and Handy Quilter um, being an international company, it needs to get all of those things signed up off before we can import it. And that's just the way it is. So we, we, we await information on when that will be. In the meantime, for those customers who are champing at the bit and want a bit of a bargain, Purple Friday promotions all the way through to the end of November is going to be something you should definitely take a look at because check out what we've got. So, so the thinking here is that, of course, it's Black Friday coming up in November, but yeah. uh, Handy Quilter, instead of having Black Friday, have kept with the corporate colours and called it Purple Friday, but rather than having a single day, yeah. they're having a, a whole month. November. 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 We started today. So, in fact, actually, a customer who came earlier this week, we were able to offer her this, um, the deeper discount of, of these machines. So... I'm going to start with the Sweet 16. The Sweet 16 on a standard table. All right. So the Sweet 16 has been um, a stalwart of the Handy Quilter stable for quite some years. And it's been a fabulous machine, much loved by those people who've been using it. And we've sold a lot in the UK. Um, when we had the Sweet and the Avanti, the Sweet was a huge seller for us when, when I was working at the Cotton Patch. And it has continued to be a really good seller. It's extremely valuable in terms of its secondhand value. It sort of really retains its value. So this is going to be a really good buy because uh, the usual price is 5,495. And we've got a special offer just while stocks last on this. So limited stocks, brand new five year warranty, 4,495, thousand pounds saving. Okay, limited stocks and it includes an extension table. So we can extend out, I've got an extension table next next door, Pete, I think. I, do you want to go? It, it gives we, you an extra 18, inch, 18 inches of width on either side of the table, so it can support your quilt a bit yep, further. It comes up here. Um, I've got one next door, but we didn't get it. So that's worth 185 pounds. Add that onto the thousand pound saving. Fantastic, absolutely brilliant machine. I'm just, shall I do a little bit of stitching, Pete, before we go on to the next one? Why not? Let me um, say hello to a few people. Yeah. Because sure. I think one of, the, one of the joys of being in Houston was to actually meet up with some of our US it followers, It was. Wasn't it? <gasps> oh gosh, it was so funny. Pete did make a little bit of fun of me that, you know, had no, people, it was lovely. Honestly, it was so lovely. We were walking in the long atrium, it takes five minutes to walk in, and a long atrium. And this lady said, hello, Liz and Pete, didn't she? It was like out of the blue. And she, she watches this on Facebook Live. So if you're watching now or on catch up, hello. And we also met Pat. We met Pat. From Wisconsin, who's actually watching this afternoon. So oh, fantastic. It was great to meet you on the yeah. as well, Pat. Oh, it was. It was really lovely. Was Pat there with her daughter? She was. That was it. Yeah. Hi, Pat. 
just double checking that was who, who you were. Yeah, it was really nice to meet you. And it is great to have this sort of international audience of, of keen long arm quilters um, who, who watch us. It's really nice. My microphone isn't working, but everything's switched on. So. Oh, you might want to um, repair. Okay. If you do the pair, yeah. you turn it off and then repair. All right, we have no Pete. Pete will be, so what did you say? Yes, it was, it was Pat. I think he missed, he might have missed that. Right, let's have a go at a little bit of quilting. I'm going to get my um, sweet spots, which are just over here. Make sure I don't press my microphone. So I've just restarted my microphone. Maybe somebody can let me know if you can hear me now. Right, Pete's just restarted his microphone. So if you can hear Pete as well as me, let us know. Can you hear Pete? His microphone has been restarted and repaired. That's repaired. Right, let's do it. Sweet 16. Standard table, it's just going to be manual, okay? There's no magic eyes in here, um, but you can set the percentage speed. So it comes with a standard foot. This is actually um, an extra large foot um, that you can get as an extra. But I love the Sweet 16. It's such a beautiful machine. It just sounds great, you know? Mm. See if, you should see if I can do some of the designs that I learnt when I was in the States. Did some great classes. Good. Seems as if I'm back online. So if you saw um, Anna's coat at the start of this episode, this is the sort of stuff that yeah. she has done on yeah, this yeah. Well, I, 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 yeah, I mean, gosh, I'm not sure I can do as well as Anna did. She did some beautiful work. And we did that one class, didn't we, with um, Heidi, where we did this design for you. We did. Just flip that all the way around. It would have been quicker if I'd done the other way around. There we go. Off we go again. And if you did see some of the coverage from Houston, you may have seen uh, Helen Godden's quilt, which oh. was called My Australia. Biggest quilt I've ever seen, I think. 20 feet oh, long so by about six feet tall. And that was done on the Sweet 16 it of was. all things. Quite it incredible. It was absolutely brilliant. Yeah, Helen's quilt, fabulous. Because we can do ruler work and everything else with this. Couching, we can do micro quilting. That was at that was at thirty percent speed, so you know we can go a lot faster. a bit of ribbon candy. Sorry, am I just quilting for this Facebook Live, do you think? It looks like it. It does look like it. Mm. 
Mm, you're getting much better at that ribbon candy. There's a bit of a ribbon candy quilt off, isn't there, between us, Pete? Because you definitely had inbuilt muscle memory ribbon candy, whereas I'd never done ribbon candy before I started quilting. And your ribbon candy is way better than mine. All right. So just to reiterate, this lovely machine, brand new, brand new, while stocks last, standard table, height adjustable, with an extension table is 4495. And that offer is on until the end of November, but get in quick, because we have limited stocks of this one. That, that option is not, um, we haven't got many left. Okay. And we are now, oh, so the other option is to have the same machine with the Insight table. Don't have one in the Insight table, but we're gonna look at the Capri so I can show you what the actual features are of the Insight table. And the usual price on the Insight table is 6495, thousand pounds saving, 5495. These are all gonna be on our Facebook page and on our website, so don't worry if you don't hear the prices. Let's move over. We're gonna go over to this one. And it is threaded up, marvelous. There we go. All right. So this time I'm going to get my paddles. <clears throat> Easier to see if you just turn that lighting down a little bit, Liz. Okay. Lighting's very bright, so it makes everything else uh, nice. very contrasty for when you're trying to film. It does. Yeah. Yeah, it's brilliant from the quilting point of view. But actually, um, a tip for if you're doing any white on white or anything where it's of same color um, on the fabric is to actually turn the lights down and get some sideways light on it. You'll find it a lot, lot easier. Someone did some lovely quilting on here. This is actually computerized. Must be off the computer one. Now, on here, this is the big difference between the standard table and the insight table is this. This insert here, we have a different size one for the Sweet 16, but the Capri one has got um, the same thing with the magic eyes, but just the shape of it is slightly longer. So you get a different one for the uh, Sweet 16. Same function, two magic eyes. We go on to regulated mode and we select how many stitches per inch and also whether we want it in precision, precise mode, where you stop, machine stops, even if it's mid-stitch. Or cruise mode, where it continues to cycle, to stitch, however many stitches per minute you decide to key in. So here we go, this is, this is the difference. Yeah, I can do manual mode in this. So I'm gonna do is needle down, needle up, pull up my bobbin thread, and do some securing stitches, use the screen, to do that. And then in manual mode, I set however many stitches per minute, same as on the suite. actually 550 stitches a minute. I go a little, a little faster. It's kind of like a sweet spot. I think it's worth saying that the designs in orange were not turned on the Capri. No, I'm not, I'm not going to try and do that. It's a Carly Porter design. This so, is really lovely to use. The inside table is very, very smooth. It's this super smooth, very, very shiny surface. And um, it really does make it extremely easy to move. And I, I love it with the paddles. I'm just gonna go a little faster. So this is manual mode still. Love muscle shell. A little kick in it. Such an effective quilting design. Yeah. And quick too. It does, it builds really well. There we go. 
Needle, at the moment, set in the up position, but for ruler work, you'd set it to the down position. Let's have a look at regulated mode. So in regulated mode, as, it slow, as I slow down, it slows down. So now I'm getting much more regular stitches, even though I'd like to think I was fairly, fairly good at getting my stitches even. This is much more even. So if I were to do, as I slow down, it slows down. Oh, might do a little bit of feather work here. So I'm building up one side of my feather. Backtrack. So Glenis, who's one of our customers in Kent, says that she has a Sweet 16 with the Insight table, but she often uses it in the manual mode too. Mm -hmm. She thinks it's a brilliant machine. Yes, and Glenis does some absolutely beautiful work on her Sweet 16. Okay, some feathers. Backtrack. You always go slower for the backtracking because in stitch regulated mode, it's going to slow down and just go slower with you. So then you can get that much more precise. I'm going to backtrack that one. And the final one there to come down the stem. And again, you can go much more slowly down the stem. And there's my feather. Okay. So that is the Capri, thousand pounds saving. Again, um, with this one, the Insight table, this one actually, oh, this one, no, it's, it's more, more than it? a thousand pounds saving. It's more, it's more. Usual price, 7,495. We've got, I mean, we've, we've, never, we've never sold any of these at this price, have we? In fact, Pete was saying that the price on the Sweet 16 is very close to what we sold it at. I think it's got to be... Well, with the Insight table that we, comes with it, it's as it's cheaper than it was... That's right. ...ten years ago. Yeah, exactly, which is incredible. And this one, the Capri, saved £1,500. And this one, it's, it is a clearance. These, this is going to be discontinued. So it doesn't mean that the machine isn't great and that they won't carry spares for a long, long time. It will This continue. just means that it will be replaced by other newer models. Um, and it'll continue in the States as under a different guise, yep. made for other manufacturers. So you don't have to worry about that bit. And Tandy Quarter will continue to support it like all of their machines. Yep. And we're still supporting machines that are 14, 15 years old. Absolutely. And spare parts are still available. Yep. And we carry some and also Handy Quarter carry some too. So, well, they, include, you know, they carry all of them. Includes on-site installation. I come along. Maybe Pete will come along. Uh, now that I can slightly do feathers. Now, now feathers are <laughs> Pete, within Pete's um, sphere of creativity. Yeah, fantastic. We all saw them, Pete. You can't deny it. You're, you're up there now. You're, you're available to do the Capri 18 installation and demonstrate feathers. There we go. I think, they'd, pre I think they'd prefer the face of pinhole quilting, which I is you. I know that they do, actually, Pete. I think <laughs> they rather like you behind the camera. Uh, right. Now, the other things that we've got on special offer, um, what's the time? How are we doing? Yeah, uh, we won't demo them today only because I've got the classes and everything all set up. But the Moxie, we've got a de deal on that that's now uh, 4995 with the eight foot loft frame and with the little foot frame, it's also 4995. Um, so that's a really good saving. £500 off both of those options. Eight foot loft frame or little foot frame. And you can add to these. If you want a 10 foot frame, you just get that deal and then add on the 10 foot option, which is a two foot additional section. 
Simply 16, we've got a deal on the eight foot loft frame, usual price 6995, now 5745, so a saving of 1250. These are fantastic savings, honestly, absolutely brilliant. And then the Simply 16 with the little foot frame is a saving of 1250 pounds as well, down to 5745. So both the late eight foot loft frame and the little <coughs> foot frame, but the benefit of the little foot frame is if you're really restricted on space. And we sold, a lady came along earlier this week and we, we, she bought one of these, um, you get a little buddy kit. So if you're primarily making the smaller quilts, 45 inch wide is typically, you know, what you might be doing for uh, crib quilts, cot quilts, uh, or for charity quilts, then that option is fantastic. Imagine how quickly you can finish all those quilt tops that you've got residing in your uh, sewing room, unfinished. I have seen them. I have, not yours, obviously. I've seen other people's, and there's a lot of them out there. So um, if you are interested in any of these offers, I'll just um, let you know that um, anything that's self-installed, obviously you'll need to install it, uh, but there are some installation ones on there. Um, the one that's installation actually is the Capri. 500 pound deposit, that's all you need. 500 pounds to secure it by the 30th of November and the balance 14 days before delivery or installation. You'd need to have it either delivered or installed. You, we, don't, you, you, we won't check up on you whether you've installed it by the 28th of February, don't worry about that. But as long as we've delivered it to you by that date, there's a supplement for Ireland and Highlands and Islands, um, 200 pounds for Ireland and 100 pounds for Highlands and Islands. Um, so that's for the, it's, it's 200 pounds for Ireland, isn't it? Yes. But for Northern Ireland, it's 100 pounds extra. Is that correct, Pete? Uh, yes. I think it is. Yes, it is. He said yes. He said yes. Anything where you want us to quote for um, installation, if you are not able to self-install it, which is perfectly fine. There are lots of people who can't do it themselves, who might want to avail themselves of the engineers to install the machine. Let us know. We'll give you a quote. And I think that's it. That's it, isn't it? Yeah. So um, these, just, just to sort of Summarise, we have never had machine discounts like this ever before. Never. And the reason is twofold. Firstly, that we're trying to clear some stocks yeah. to make space for new machines coming from Handy Quarter, like the Moxie XL, which we are certain will be very popular. Yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, so it's clearing. Yeah. It's clearing stocks, well, making room. That's really awful. the main reason. Making room, making room, clearing stocks. And in, in and some cases, is... for Handy Quarter, they're clearing stocks themselves that's right so they're giving us discounts on machines at the moment exactly yes yes <clears throat> i mean that's the good thing is that their purple promotion we are able to take advantage of that they've um given us the options on that so, yeah i mean i think actually since we've been going we've never been able to participate in the discounts no. that handy quarter usa has has had in the u.s market mm -hmm. um, but we're very pleased to be able to yeah. get them this time Absolutely. and to be able to pass on those savings thank you amber Thank you, Amber, yes. <laughs> Amber's brilliant. Amber comes over to Festival of Quilts. And uh, yeah, so it's great to see Amber over at Houston. And um, what did we have? We had some, uh, some very interesting, we went out for dinner with Amber and that was lovely. It's always nice to get to know the people that we deal with at Handy Quilter. Um, so it's, it was great to see Amber. Um, Purple November machine promotion then, if you're thinking about it, do not delay. These, these offers will not be around beyond November. And I'm sure that people will take advantage of these. So the other thing is, is that um, on that email I just sent out are some second user pre-loved machines as well. There's some very good ways of getting a long arm that don't necessarily involve the bigger investment of a larger machine or buying new when you can actually buy a second user. And for those of you who, who keep an eye on that website, you'll see quite a lot of them gone since before, when we were um, just going to Houston, we had, um, I think we had six or seven on there. Anyway, there's, there's three, there's three left. So that's, you know, these things, they do turn over um, and it's important, you know, if you're interested in any of those, don't hesitate, do not hesitate. Okay, Peter. Yeah. 
Um, we are going to be doing this live again next Friday, are we not? We are, I think. So we are, because, yes. Yeah, because we're not. We've done class. Oh, we don't. We're looking forward to seeing everybody at the classes next week. I should just mention the other things I was going to talk about. Classes next week, Tuesday. We've got foundation workshop um, with lots of our new um, handy quarter owners. Then we've got the landscape workshop, which is going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be busy in here. We've got a whole range of. Actually, we've got some. Yeah, we've got some people who've been on classes many times before through to people who it will be their first class. So the landscape workshop that Carolyn James is leading, I'm back up and support wing woman. And Carolyn is going to be the tour de force that is Carolyn James. And she will be taking everybody through some of the really interesting techniques. I will probably cover taking two threads through the needle and doing some interesting things like that, because that's what I like to do too. Um, it's going to be a fantastic day. If it was really popular when we launched it and we sold out like the first day, um, if you are interested in the landscape workshop, add it to your wish list. We actually see how many people want to have it on their wish list, and that gives us an indication of whether we should run it again. So on the website, handybuilder.co.uk, landscape workshop wish list. The other thing is we've got another foundation workshop on Thursday. That's with another cohort of our new customers. Um, so we very much welcome um, them to the classroom next week. We're looking forward to welcoming you to the classroom next week. You see, this is the jet lag. It's not quite as verbose as I should be. I'm not doing too badly, though, Pete, considering it's Friday. Well, we should have started to recover by now, really, shouldn't we? We really should. It's, it's, I don't, like I say, I don't normally get jet lag, so this is kind of a bit of a weird one for me. Anyway, I think we should wrap it up soon, unless I know you're typing, he's typing away, he's answering questions, multitasking, as always. Pete's done a couple of installations this week, hasn't, haven't you? Yes. And I'm going to put, oh, there's a little video that we'll do um, mm -hmm. of um, one of the ladies who had an upgraded Upgraded uh, her frame. Simply 16 from a little foot frame to yeah. a studio frame yes. yesterday. Yeah, I've got more installations next week. I'm Absolutely. down in Sussex next week doing an installation. Yeah. I've got one near Worcester that I'm doing with Pro Stitcher. That's right. We've got... <laughs> In a huge number of installations coming up in oh, the next few weeks. Oh, it's quite amazing. Including our engineer Derek in Northern Ireland, yes. who's doing installations both in Northern and Southern Ireland for us. He is, he is. And he did a lovely installation of an Amara ST for the three sisters uh, that I posted on Facebook earlier um, in the week. He did it at the weekend, I believe. Um, so welcome to the Handy Quilter family. All of those new customers who are out there going, oh, it's a big machine, but it's just it's just a big sewing machine. Remember that. It's not scary. It's It really is doable, manageable. Everything that you want to do on this machine, let us know if you get stuck. If you do get stuck, we're here to help. So with no further ado, I'm going to wish you a very, very happy weekend of quilting. Be inspired by Anna that we started a Facebook Live with, who yes. just literally got on, got a piece of fabric, did a really interesting color combo with that and just went, I'm just going to go for it. Absolutely. And she hasn't been quilting very long, Pete. No, she remember? hasn't. So if I you think... missed the start of this live broadcast, and I know quite a few of you joined a bit later, yeah. have a look at the very beginning where our customer, Anna, just happened to turn up at the showroom and we Absolutely. commandeered her, press ganged her into appearing just with like her it. amazing quilted coat. Yes. At one point, Anna said, how, how did it go from just taking a photo to being on Facebook Live? I don't know. I don't know how that happened, Anna. But anyway, it was lovely to see you. Love the coat. And thank you very much for being a really good sport and taking part in our Facebook Live. So everybody, have a wonderful weekend and week until we see you again. And happy quilting.